This 33-year-old woman is a Texan through and through. She's lived in Texas all her life. So why does she sound like this? I'm a true Texan, born and raised. Lisa Alamia sure sounds like she's from London, but she's never even been there. I've never been to England. I've never been to any European country, actually. This is how the mom of three, who lives outside Houston, used to sound. We just want you to know how blessed we are to have you guys as our pastors. So what the heck is going on here? Last December, Lisa underwent jaw surgery to fix an overbite. When she woke up, she sounded like Mary Poppins. A spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. This isn't me. This doesn't sound like me. This, I don't want this. Why did it happen to me? Just asking why. Lisa was diagnosed with a bizarre medical condition known as foreign accent syndrome. Dr. Toby Yeltho is her neurologist. I was skeptical at first, of course, trying to determine if it was real. We wanted to make sure this was not a psychiatric disorder. Hey, Kylie, you got to hang a little bit. Foreign accent syndrome is very rare. Only 100 cases have been reported in the last 100 years. What I hear on the street most often is um, British. Karen Butler is from Oregon, but following dental surgery, she spoke like a woman from Ireland. He started out with being Dudley. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't answer to that one. Say that again. Dudley. She'll say something we have no idea um, at all what she's trying to refer to. Now Lisa Alamia from Texas has to deal with the skeptics who question whether her new accent is genuine or a gigantic put on. It's not fake. It's an actual syndrome, but because it's so rare and so unheard of, People think it's easier to just say, oh, she's faking it. Can you get your dad? Her family says Lisa's foreign accent definitely is the real deal, and it's taking a little getting used to. It did freak me out at first, but I think it's hilarious. Lisa's undergoing speech therapy to lose her English accent. I'm trying to pick up an American accent, so for somebody to say, you don't sound British to me, to me it's a compliment. Thank you, because it shows me that what I'm doing is working.